We are just learning new information about this morning's breaking news as police search for a suspect following stabbings in Kalamazoo. News Channel 3's Jessica Wheeler has been on scene outside the Canterbury House apartments for more than an hour now. And Jessica, you now believe this is a standoff situation. What's the latest? Yeah, Kirk, we just uh, got confirmation from the Sheriff's Department that the suspect is holed up inside one of the apartments here at Canterbury House. I'll let you see the very active scene that is still going on here. In fact, just within the last five minutes, uh, at least a half a dozen more officers have arrived on scene, many of them putting on their SWAT gear. Uh, you can see them, uh, the ones that are on scene have been coming back to their cars even to get their SWAT gear on. What we're told is that the suspect is inside of an apartment here at Canterbury house. Uh, at this point, they're not sure if they have a hostage or not. That person has said that they do. They're still working to confirm that. We saw just about five o'clock this morning uh, an officer run two children out of the house. I have confirmed that those two children were inside of the apartment uh, that this suspect is in right now. Uh, I'm told the sheriff is on his way to the scene. He is expected to brief us, give us more information about exactly what has happened here. We know this started as a stabbing. When we got on scene, we were told by an officer to be careful because they had a stabbing suspect on the loose and he was stabbing multiple people. We saw an ambulance leave the scene here, uh, but we do not know how many victims there have been, but we know this has turned into a standoff. Again, this is Canterbury House Apartments. We're right off of Green Meadows Drive, off of Drake Road, uh, all the way at the end of Green Meadows Drive here. We're going to stay on scene. We'll have another update for you in about 10 minutes. Reporting live in Kalamazoo, Jessica Wheeler, News Channel 3.